I was born with cystic fibrosis. As I, you know, got older, I'd spend a lot of time at the hospital. I'd had to make it my second home because I was there often. I started developing a fever. Fever usually means a sign of infection. Things started getting worse. I ended up on a BiPAP. After that, I've gotten to the point where I got real bad and ended up on ECMO. After being there for about a month and a half, uh, I was able to uh, have the team come in. They were talking to me. The surgeon, maybe like three hours later, comes in. Tells me, hey, we found your lungs. Your surgery is going to be at 3 p.m. At uh, year 2019, I was able to get my double lung transplant. It's something that changed my life completely because before and after, completely different lives. So far, I was able to get back to uh, my career, EMT at Trace Ambulance, trying to make the difference that the uh, medical staff did for me to other people. Throughout the whole time, I've been a patient at University of Chicago. Great uh, health team, and they also, they're the second family, my second family. I appreciate very much everything they've done for me. They were not only there to help me medically, but they also helped me mentally and, you know, with their positiveness, their, you know, their smiles, the way that they love their job and how they care for the patient is, it's huge. It's just real important to be an organ donor just because my life was saved and many other lives were saved. So your organs do make a difference. You can save lives. I want to do everything I can to make my organ donor proud of me. I'd uh, say thank you because of you I'm here today. <laughs>